Hello, my name is Ari Isaac. I'm a GIS analyst at the Port of San Diego. Um, and uh, today I wanted to show you how to print or save an image or print a PDF. Um, this is uh, this is the Port of San Diego's um, GIS system. It's based on ArcGIS Explorer and ArcGIS Server. Uh, this is our first uh, service, which is um, the Atlas. But uh, I was thinking we could uh, use Seaport Village as our example. As we zoom in, you know, we get to Seaport Village. And let's rotate this. Let's put this up a little bit. Okay, let's get some good some good horizon real quick. Oopsie, that's... Let's reset the north arrow. There we go. There we go. That's what we want. We want to say parcel number three. So, um, in order to create a PDF, you just go File, Print, and then you uh, enter a title. Let's call it Seaport. Seaport. And you select in your printers. Just make sure you select this cute PDF writer to create a PDF. Um, and let's make it landscape. And press OK. It says, and then it pops up a little thing. It says, where do you want to save it? I'm going to save it to my desktop. I'm going to call it seaport.pdf. Save. And then, uh, and then it shows up right there. Let's open it back up, and there it is. Um, one thing I wanted to point out here is, uh, here I'll make it smaller so we all can see it, I guess, a little bit. We've got to shove it in. We only have certain real estate to make these movies. Uh, so there we go. Okay, basically what it does is um, it adds whatever line you added in there so uh, you can um, get, it, get something out. Uh, but I just wanted to point out that this um, and this can't be changed. Uh, if you've worked with ESRI products um, before, um, you know that you have all kinds of options to print things out. But in this case, this is just to get out a down and dirty print. Um, another thing I wanted to point out that this scale bar is 75 feet. I believe it's 75 feet in the center of the page. So, um, you know, this number three, that might not be 75 feet or um, all along the horizon back here it's not 75 feet so if you're looking at something uh, that's in uh, 3D mode as opposed to 2D mode um, well this would be 3D mode let me give you an example of 2D 2D mode would be if you reset the tilt now the whole page is 70, 74 feet 72 feet um, but uh, if you're looking at something like this um, you got to be careful with the scale um, and the north arrow and the ESRI and this copyright thing that can't be changed. There's no uh, there's no options to changing that. So that's a PDF um, and this will work. I have Acrobat, but um, this will work with um, uh, Reader as well. Uh, if you want to create an image, let's zoom out. Let's take another image. Let's go somewhere else. There we go. Let's do page 82 of the map book. There we go. Let's just do uh, that. We don't have much space, so let's just uh, let's just do that. You do file, or you do um, if you first if you want to print, you just do print the exact same thing except you choose your printer. That'll print. If you want to do an image, it's just uh, view view. Copy view to clipboard, and then um, start all programs, and accessories, paint, and then uh, paint will open up. This is a program everybody should have on their computer, and you go edit, um, paste, and then it just pastes your image in whatever in the inside of this, um, inside of the screen will paste, and then you can, uh, you know, write write anything you want on it. You can, you, you know write little notes or uh, you know draw arrows or that kind of thing um, if you wanna make another point or uh, you know whatever whatever you uh, wanna do with it uh, anyway and then from here you can go file save as and you can save it as a JPEG bitmap a TIFF a GIF PNG file so you have all of your your basic image options right out of here 
Um, and so I think that that's, uh, that's how to print, how to print a PDF, um, and how to um, create an image. I want to, last thing I want to show you, this is uh, the help, ArcGIS Explorer help. Um, it's got all kinds of in good information about, uh, you know, where, um, where working with the map, like how to uh, do different things, map projections, like learning, like learning about map projections, working with results. So you want to add a HTML little pop up to a point or something, um, uh, and all kinds of all kinds of other things. Um, and so I just wanted to point you to the help, and that this is a really good spot. Uh, again, my name is uh, Ari Isaac. I'm a GIS analyst at the Port of San Diego. My phone number is 619-400-4778, uh, and my extension is 4778. My email is aisaak at portofsandiego.org, and my favorite color is blue. Anyway, I, uh, I hope you uh, enjoyed this podcast, and um, keep checking the blog, and um, we'll, we're, we're continuing to work on new stuff, and so uh, the blog should be regularly updated. Anyway, um, hope you have a great uh, day. Talk to you later. Bye.